TVS Apache RR310, what to expect. TVS Motor Company will launch its flagship motorcycle, the full-fared TVS Apache RR310 on December 6, 2017. The Apache RR310 has been developed by TVS and manufactured at the TVS factory in Hasar, Tamil Nadu. But it shares its underpinnings with the BMW G310R, BMW Motrad's 300cc naked street bike, which is the product of a joint venture and collaboration between TVS Motor Company and BMW Motrad. But, what is the Apache RR310? And will it be any different from the BMW G310R, which is also manufactured in the same factory and is already on sale in markets abroad? Here's a look at what you can expect from the latest sport bike from TVS, the Apache RR310. Also read, TVS Apache RR310, Price Expectation. The TVS Apache RR310 will be a product designed in-house by the TVS design and engineering team. It will be the first full-fared motorcycle from the TVS stable and going with the way TVS Motor Company's past products in the Apache series have been executed, expect top-notch build quality and finish on the Apache RR310. It will be designed as a full-fared sport bike, but expect TVS to make the riding position and ergonomics suitable for everyday use, as well as the occasional racetrack duties. We've already seen some of the equipment the TVS Apache RR310 is going to offer from the numerous spy shots of the bike undergoing testing on public roads. Expect a feature-rich experience, with an all-digital vertically stacked instrument panel which will have a wide range of data, including lap timers, like the one on the Apache RDR204 volts. Headlights are expected to be full LED projector lights and LED taillights as well. Expect all new high-quality switch gear which will have easy ergonomics for intuitive use by the rider. Also read, TVS Apache RR310 launch date revealed. The TVS Apache RR310 will be powered by the same reverse-inclined, single-cylinder, 313cc, 4-valve, dock engine which makes around 34 bhp of maximum power at 9500 revolutions per minute and 28 newton meters at 7500 revolutions per minute like the bmw the apache rr310 will also have a six-speed transmission and high quality disc brakes gripped by four piston calipers at the front wheel the bmw g310r's curb weight is around 158 kilograms but expect the Apache RR310 to be marginally heavier, at around 170 kg, due to the extra weight of the full fairing. Performance is likely to be similar to the BMW G310R, but the addition of the full fairing may give the Apache RR310 a marginally better top speed. For comparison, the BMW G310R has a claimed maximum speed of 143 kmph. So expect the Apache RR310 to have a maximum speed upwards of 150 kmph. We expect the TVS Apache RR310 to be priced under or just around 2 lock, X showroom. Even if TVS manages to price it between 1.8 lock and 2.2 lock, it will offer a superb alternative to the entry-level performance motorcycle segment and will compete with a wide range of motorcycles from the Mahindra Mojo. KTM 250 Duke, KTM 390 Duke, KTM RC 390, Benoit E 302R and even the Bajaj Dominer. Also read, TVS Apache RR310 teased a new video ahead of debut. The TVS Apache RR310 will be positioned as a premium sport bike, designed with learnings from 35 years of TVS racing experience. The TVS BMW Motrad collaboration has certainly put TVS Motor Company in a different league of global motorcycle manufacturers, whose products like the BMW G310R is being sold across the world, and in established markets like Europe and the US. Positioned as a premium sport bike, we have no reason to believe that TVS will be offering a low-spec variant of the Apache RR310 without ABS, so we expect a single high-spec variant with ABS, which will be positioned as TVS Motor Company's brand new global product. 
targeted not just at the domestic market, but with an eye on TVS global ambitions as well. For the latest auto news and reviews, follow Car and Bike on Twitter, Facebook, and subscribe to our YouTube channel.